Young little girl is dead, her sister hospitalized after being found in a hot car last night. The story is from York Township in Medina County. News Channel 5's Mario Liu is reporting live from outside Metro Health Medical Center where the one survivor is being treated. Mario. Leon, good afternoon. You know, it's such a tragic story. I've been in close communication all morning long with the chief deputy investigating this case. He tells me that three-year-old survivor is fighting for her life this afternoon in critical condition, and police are already calling this a tragic accident. 911, where's your emergency? I got two kids in this one. How old are they? Three and two. A frantic call from a grandfather searching for his two granddaughters. You said that you last saw about two hours ago? Something like that. I thought they were sleeping. And then I just found out from the babysitters that they're gone. But the girls weren't napping. They had wandered out of the house and up the street. Chief Deputy Kenneth Baca was one of the first on the scene. There was enough officers on the scene at the time that we were able to search the residence and simultaneously the canine unit along with other officers were able to perform a field search around the pond. Police put out automated calls to put neighbors on the lookout. But then the unimaginable. Shortly thereafter, uh, my attention was called uh, to the uh, residence to the north by the uh, homeowner there stating that she had found the children that they were in her car. They were in poor condition at the time obviously from being inside a vehicle for a period of time with the heat the way it was. Uh, we began uh, CPR on the one and, and life-saving techniques on the other. The two-year-old died en route to the hospital. Her three-year-old sister was placed on a critical condition at Metro. Police are already calling it a tragic accident. This wasn't something where where somebody went out and, and deliberately left the children in the car to go into a, to a store to go shopping. This was something where the children were out playing. They were able to get to the vehicle. They were they were able to manipulate the door handle on the car, and they got inside the car and they were playing. And, and unfortunately, they succumbed to the to the intense heat that uh, that was inside the car. Such a sad story. Again, that three-year-old is in critical condition at this moment. According to police, the girl's parents were both out of town uh, at the time of this incident. We have not been able to reach them for comment. Leon? Just a tragic story all the way around, Mariel. I know you've been with it all morning long, and once again, you've not talked to the parents uh, uh, of the girls, right? That is, that is what you reported. Is that correct? That's exactly right, Leon. They were out of town when this happened. You could only imagine rushing back and having to deal with all of this. The media is the last thing, understandably, that they're thinking about. We also reached out to neighbors, but it's just such a terrible story and such a tragedy that it's really uh, something that people in, the, in that area who experienced this just still need some time to heal before they can talk about it. And